Hi, this is Karen in behalf of Matt Lloyd and Moab, and today we're going to call Victoria Ray, who has earned $1,250. She's a diamond consultant. So let's go ahead and give her a call and see what she has to say about it. Hello. Hi, is this Vicki? Yes, it is. Hi, this is Karen calling in behalf of Matt Lloyd and Moab. How are you doing? I'm doing good, Karen. Thank you for calling. Oh, well, I'm excited to call you because I get to tell you all about your good news $1,250 sale. Nice. That's <laughs> that, that is my first large sale. I'm very excited oh, about that. Congratulations. That's awesome. And doesn't it feel so good? It really does. And, and this one was unique because I, you know, I had, I, I've been promoting the 21 Steps through Facebook and it's some we sell good traffic. And this one sale, I I had given up hope on this person because they never responded to me by email right. or text. And next thing I knew, I got a cha-ching email. And it was so exciting. I, I, you know, the coaches and Matt Lloyd and Mo didn't give up on this person. And it, it was very exciting to see that they decided to move along. So I'm very happy for them and I'm happy for me. <laughs> Absolutely, and now you've just proved that you can make it work, and you just have to duplicate over and over again. Exactly, yes. Yes, I'm looking forward to doing that. So tell us a little bit about yourself. What was your profession before you found MOBE? Uh, so I uh, worked as a government employee, very um, stressful job, not happy at all. <clears throat> found myself wanting more out of my life and getting more and more depressed, and Decided, you know, I, I need to change. There was, you know, so I need to pull myself out and find something. And so I started looking around, tried network marketing. Didn't really like that. Was looking at franchises, uh, looking at, you know, starting maybe a mom and pop shop. And um, one day, one of my friends who knew I was looking for something else to do, she had gone to a, a I Am Freedom workshop and signed up for the Home Business Summit okay. and invited me as a guest. And I said, okay, that sounds interesting. I'll go. Yeah. I'm not going to sign up for anything. <laughs> and when I was there, I said, this is it. This is everything I was looking for because right. I was just looking for that 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 thing that resonated with me that, right. you know, the fact that Move Authors coaches, it, it was like the best of everything I was looking for. And I was talking to the coaches there at the Home Business Summit and it just... It just clicked. Everything just seemed like it was what I was looking for. And so I went from, I'm not signing up for anything, to becoming a diamond right away. Right. Awesome. Because I saw I saw the value in, in Moab, and especially in the coaching. Uh, there was a lot of hesitation because I'm not a computer person. Okay. Uh, but I was told, if you're coachable... You can learn, and I knew that. I knew, you know, whatever you put your mind to, you can do, and especially working with the coaches who really took me by the hand and walked me through everything, and it, it's it's been a great experience. And then my other thing was the time commitment, because I was working full-time when I started it with Mo, and just finding that time during the day to, to do the 21 steps. I started doing the 21 steps on my lunch break from my cell phone. Uh, just because I knew if, if you know if I'm committed to this, there's going to be a way, and I'm going to find time to do right. it. Don't lose momentum. Yes. How has your yes, mindset so. evolved from become you know being a corporate employee to now being an entrepreneur? How has your mindset played a role and evolved? Um, my well, my mindset is still continuing to grow as I work with my coaches. You know, I, I see things from a different perspective now, and you know this this is all about me what am I motivated to do and seeing things not as a consumer seeing things more as a marketer and and it's just it's a different way to view things and and sticking to it not giving up uh, you know in, in the corporate world if something doesn't work you can always complain and just push along to somebody else or, <laughs> right. But, but now it's like it's me, so I'm going to make it work. And it, if, if, if something doesn't work, it's not a failure. It's a, a learning experience. What can I change? What, what other way can I look at it? What else can I do to, to, to figure out how to succeed? 
What was the deciding factor for you becoming a diamond? I mean, going into the Home Business Summit thinking I'm not going to do anything to now, you know, to jumping into diamond. What was that process like for you? I saw the value of being diamond, uh, not just for the commission, because if somebody else, if somebody under me signed up and went diamond, I didn't want to miss out on those commissions, but also everything that the diamond uh, offered, all of the extras, the, the video packaging and, and the, the mastermind, uh, the... Skype groups, just everything, the extra uh, traffic coaching, it just all added up to what, you know, why not, ju- I, I thought to myself, why not jump all in? If I'm going to do this, let's do it right. Let's go all the way in and get all the benefit uh, right, from the, right from the beginning. Have you attended the Diamond Mastermind yet? I have not. I've gone to Titanium okay. and I have Platinum coming up in March. How did you find the Titanium Mastermind to be for you, the training and everything? How was that? It was good. It was very good. Uh, Yes, I highly recommend going to the Masterminds for everybody. Just being around like-minded people and seeing what other people are doing and what works for them and even just seeing, uh, helping newbies. Like there's people who are at all levels at at the masterminds and, and meeting them and seeing what's working for them and sharing what is working or not working for you to try to get tips from other people and just building that network of uh, like-minded people who understand the business and, and what what's going on. Absolutely. Is there anything else you'd like to share? Any other advice you'd like to offer? Um, just keep at it. I have been with Mo for six months and it was it's been very stressful at times especially because I, I don't know a lot the, well I didn't know I know a lot more now <laughs> about the computer stuff uh, and, and I thought several times about giving up I said no you know what? I'm investing in this this is an investment in myself mm-hmm. this is something I want to do for me and so I'm not going to give up I'm just going to stick with it if I need to stop for the day and go take a nap or go to bed early just to get a new perspective the next day, I'll do that. I, I, I see things differently. I see that this is what I signed up for. This is what I'm going to do, and nothing's going to stop me. So that is a, you know, keep that, just be positive and keep going. Such good advice. Thank you so much for giving me a few minutes of your time today. Congratulations on your first silver sale. I'm so excited for you. <laughs> and I definitely Thank look forward to I definitely look forward to talking to you in the future with more of these commissions. So keep up the good work and just follow your own advice. Don't give up. Just keep at it. Be consistent and constant. And we'll hopefully be talking to you very soon. I will. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. Okay. Bye-bye.